Welcome back, everyone, to our channel. I'm Shannon, your host, and I'm here with my partner Jack. In today's video, I want to discuss a topic that I believe has a significant impact on whether or not you can progress further with a girl after the first date. The focus will be on understanding what not to ask girls when dating them. Have you ever found yourself in a situation where you thought the first or second date went well, but then the girl stops responding and the relationship fizzles out? Or perhaps a promising relationship suddenly becomes awkward? I'm quite certain that at some point, you've asked a girl something you shouldn't have. So, let's dive into the top 5 questions you should avoid asking if you want to establish a strong relationship with her. But before we begin, we kindly ask for your support by subscribing to our channel and liking this video. Your support means a lot to us and helps us continue creating content. Now, without any further delay, let's explore the 5 questions you should steer clear of when dating to ensure success with women. First of all please avoid yourself from asking about a girl's ex-boyfriends. While it's natural to be curious about her past, bringing up this topic can make the other person uncomfortable, especially on a first or second date. Even in a relationship, it's best to approach this subject with caution or avoid it altogether. Some individuals may attempt to make an impression that he is cool to the girl by asking highly inappropriate questions. These could include inquiries like, how many boyfriends have you had so far? or delving into the details of the longest and shortest relationships she has had. There may also be a tendency to inquire about the reasons for past breakups, placing blame on either her or her ex-partner. As a woman, I can tell you that questions like these would immediately signal the end of any further communication with such an individual. Everyone has their privacy, and it takes time or a deep connection before personal stories are shared, if at all. Asking these questions portrays a person as overly critical, overly controlling, and exhausting, ultimately revealing a lack of self-confidence. It's safe to say that no woman would want to meet such an individual again and might even feel compelled to leave the date immediately. The second question to avoid is asking about a girl's occupation and how much she earns. While it may be natural to be curious about someone's profession and their financial situation, asking these questions can disrupt the flow of the conversation and create an unfavorable impression, particularly if it's a first date. However, if the date is going well and you genuinely want to learn about her interests and career choices, it's possible to approach the topic in a smoother way. Instead of directly asking why she chose her career path, you can inquire about her favorite aspects of her job, what she is passionate about or currently interested in, what she enjoys doing in her free time, or what she studied in school. By expressing admiration for her work and showing genuine curiosity with a smile, you can create an environment where she feels comfortable opening up and sharing her story. When it comes to financial matters, it's crucial not to ask about how much she earns, even if you enter into a relationship. If she willingly reveals that information, that's fine, but directly asking about her income can give the impression that you are more interested in her financial status than in her as a person. Moreover, it can make you appear less confident in yourself. I have never witnessed a confident and capable individual asking a girl about her income. Let the conversation flow naturally, and show genuine interest in her story without making her feel uncomfortable or objectified. The third question that surprises me is when guys ask a girl why she is single, without any additional context or tact. Even worse, some guys ask why a girl is single at her age, which can be a major turnoff and create an uncomfortable situation. While there can be various reasons why someone is single, it's generally not appropriate to delve into this topic on a first date. Asking such a question can come across as skeptical, desperate, or imply that something is inherently wrong with the person. It's better to focus on getting to know the person, discovering shared values and goals, and building a connection. However, if you really feel the need to ask this question, it's crucial to approach it in a more thoughtful and complimentary manner. For example, you could say, I find it hard to believe someone as beautiful as you is still single. Men must have a hard time keeping up with you. This kind of lighthearted remark may evoke laughter and pique the girl's interest, but I still advise caution when using this approach. It's important to practice and be mindful of how you deliver such a question before going on a date. Focus on building a genuine connection and getting to know each other on a deeper level, rather than probing into personal matters that may make the other person uncomfortable. Another question to avoid asking on a first or second date, which can be a significant red flag, is about marriage. While you may have genuine feelings for the girl, Discussing marriage too early can create unnecessary pressure and potentially scare her away, even if she was starting to become interested in you. 
I've observed some guys asking questions like at what age do you want to get married? How many kids do you want if you get married? Do you have a preference for the gender of your future children? If the girl initiates a conversation about marriage and asks about kids, it can be a positive sign that she is highly interested in you. In such cases, it's essential to answer each of her questions and engage in the discussion. However, if you are the one initiating these conversations, she may quickly decide that it will be the last time she sees you. It's important not to rush things and give her time to develop a deeper connection. If a girl is genuinely interested in building a serious relationship, she will naturally bring up these topics. Your role is to be prepared to answer them thoughtfully, demonstrating that you are a person she can trust and envision a future with. The final question that you should never ask a girl on the first or second date is, where do you see this relationship going? I personally believe that guys who ask this question either lack common sense or are not genuinely interested in the girl. It's a peculiar question that resembles the kind of inquiry you receive in an interview. When a girl becomes engaged with you and senses that she wants to progress in the relationship, she will keep saying yes when you ask her out. This indicates her desire to get to know you better and potentially pursue a serious relationship. Additionally, if she initiates texting or suggests going out first, it's a strong indication of her interest in you. However, relationships should evolve naturally and take time. Even if a girl has a positive impression of you after the first date, that impression may quickly fade if you ask her where she sees the relationship going. Girls appreciate men who are proactive and take the lead in the relationship, rather than asking in a passive manner. Asking such a question may convey a lack of confidence in oneself. And with that, we wrap up our conversation about the five questions you should avoid asking a girl on a first or second date. I trust you found this episode to be both entertaining and enlightening, providing valuable insights into the interests and aspirations of the women who capture your interest. Thank you wholeheartedly for tuning in, and we eagerly anticipate your presence on our upcoming episode.